Good. Let's go with you. Ready? You know the Titanic? What happened to it? Well, today I sink, yesterday I sank. Sank. Right, okay. Sank. Yeah, sunk is the past participle. Good. Okay, so here we go. Ready? Why did it sink? What did it hit? Oh, an iceberg. iceberg. Okay, so here we go. The Titanic hit an iceberg. The Titanic sank. The Titanic. The, the Titanic. The So yours are sank. So okay, we have it sank. Sank. It hit an iceberg. Go ahead. So it. Sank. We'll start with this one. It. It. It hit the iceberg. So it sank. Good. Here. The Titanic sank because it hit the iceberg. Good. And here. Because hit the iceberg. Because what? The Titanic hit the iceberg. It's not. It's sunk. 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 Okay, good. Now we're going to wrap up on this note, and next week we'll learn um, more types of sentences. But your homework for this week will be giving me some of these, okay? Uh, so I just. Um, some sentence. Mm -hmm. Some sentence about this. Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna make some sentences. We're gonna make some compound sentences. So there's one thing I want to point out before we go. Okay, this is backwards. It's in verse, right? You have the effect because cause. But what we're doing here is because cause comma effect. So what we're doing is this. We're moving this over here, right? Yeah. See how that works? Yes. So I want to ask you something. Can I say it hit an iceberg so the Titanic sank? Pardon? Well, I'm using two things. I'm using a proper noun, which is the name the Titanic, and I'm using the pronoun for a ship, which is it. Can I say it hit an iceberg so the Titanic sank? No. No. Why? Because in the it it what? It is what? Exactly. Pronouns follow real nouns. It is red. No. no. The ball is on the floor. It is red. Now we know what we're talking about, right? Yes. Okay. He did his homework. Peter is sitting in the chair. Which one is first? Peter is sitting in the chair. He did his homework. Now we know who he is. So, the Titanic it's an iceberg, so it sank. The Titanic sank because it hit an iceberg. But because this one is actually this backwards, but it, we can do it the same way. Are we saying here because the Titanic hit an iceberg or because it hit an iceberg? No, the Titanic has to be in the front, remember? The Titanic sank because it hit an iceberg. So when we switch it out here to make this one, because it hit an iceberg, comma, the Titanic sank. You understand? So what we're doing is we're taking this one and just chopping, cut and paste, okay? We're just moving the effect. That's all we're doing, okay? Okay. So, the Titanic hit an iceberg, so it sank. The Titanic sank because it hit an iceberg. No. Because it hit an iceberg, the Titanic no. sank. Understand? No. Good. Here's what I want you to do. Um, Google fanboys, okay? You know what I mean? Yeah. You Google fanboys. And uh, we'll end today. Fanboys. Yeah. Okay. Number one is fanboys. Have you written down all of this? 
In your book? Yeah. yeah. Good, because we're going to continue this next week, okay? So here's what we're doing right now. Co. 